Good morning, guys, and happy Monday, man. It was a great day yesterday. I get done with that rug in the back. As you can see in the garage, I just like to follow my mind, my instinct. Yesterday, I came home and the weather was nice and beautiful and something keep telling me, you know what? Just do this rug today. It's a beautiful day. You don't know what tomorrow is gonna bring. And I just like doing that. Wake up this morning and we had a little dusting. <laughs> yes, after that perfectly yesterday, and I was saying, you know, we didn't get any snows yet. But beside that, I am grateful, I'm happy. No matter what, I'm standing on the ground after living. So let me just flip the camera around and show you what we got this morning. As you can see, it's just a little dusting, nothing much. Just to remind us, it's out there and it's gonna come, but that's how life is. Life reminds us that things are gonna happen and the Almighty, our God, remind us that He is still in control. So just before I leave home for my first job, I just want to show you, you know, we had a little dusting this morning and this is New England. Anything happened, <laughs> any given time. But the sun is about to come out again and this is all going to be melt away like it never happened. So guys, when I get to my first job, I'll come back and show you what I'm working on this morning. Okay guys, so we are at the job and this is the building I'll be cleaning this morning. As you can see, it's one, two, three levels, four levels and all. I'll be doing the third level at the fourth level. And you can see the problem about getting hoses up there. I don't want to be doing all of that because this is where I'm parked and that's where I'm going. So the next step is VLM. So long different method of cleaning. When I get inside, I'm going to show you exactly what I'll be doing. Okay, so we are inside of the apartment. Give you a little walkthrough. As you can see, they've been doing some work inside. Just been painting over the wall, getting it ready for the new tenant that's coming in. It's a senior living uh, facility. It's a four story building. So. Um, this person here move out and they're having somebody new coming in and you can see where they had the table here and you can see over here it's fairly like it's new because whatever they had here maybe a chair or a, a sofa or something and then you can see that was the traffic here you can see how that's matted down from the constant movement over the years. So I'll be cleaning this carpet. I'll be doing some VLM on these. And it comes back around into the, the barn bedroom here. There's no light in here. You can see the same thing. All the paint chip on the floor. I'll be cleaning this. Just wiping down these, the way the seals, uh, the closet, and the kitchen here, cleaning the floor, wiping out the, uh, the cupboards. That's a general cleaning, the fridge. Um, I start working for this. For this company about late down last year anytime they have move out i come and i do the carpets and uh, apartment you know just a general wipe down of the cupboard the stove the fridge um, i used to do a lot of this when i first started move out moving but i just kind of uh, move away from it because it's not really my cup of tea but where the carpet is involved, they asked me if I would like to clean the apartment while I'm here. I say, yes, once we come to a price agreement that's suitable for me, I will do it. So I give them my price, they say it's okay. Plus the carpet, 
So why walk over money when you already here and just take it and do it one time. So guys, let me get started. Let me get everything up and ready. Um, I'll be doing the kitchen first. I'm just gonna show you the after and before. I'm not gonna be doing the recording of cleaning the fridge and the stove and anything like that. I'm gonna show you that after when I finish. So you can see how it looks now. Um, it's very clean inside. You know, zinc. I showed you this before. There's some little food particles left there in the fridge inside, but I'm gonna show you that after I finish, but I'm not gonna be doing the recording for this. All right, guys, so I'll catch you guys later. Okay, so we finish the kitchen, the fridge, everything inside here. Remember all the food, some food that was inside. Everything is clean. The counter, these are gonna stay here. We're gonna put these back up later stove inside cupboards so now I just have the carpet to vacuum did the bathroom I put the tables back because I'm using these this floor dry is very quick this is just low medium floor That was done. And then these windows, you may see some streaks, but that's outside. So I wipe the seal, everything now vacuum in time. Apartment buildings are very good to have, and of course, especially right now in the winter time when most of the traffic cleaning staff is still on. In a place like New England, you can come in and you can just do the, the move in, move out. You can down the store, deep clean the store, fridge. All of that stuff. It keeps you, it keeps you busy. And you still have some money coming in. You're still doing some carpet cleaning on the side because you're doing VLM and all of the apartments. So, it's not a bad, it's not a bad thing to look into. You just gotta charge accordingly, so you can. Make a profit and you're not wasting your time. Um, the customers are not taking advantage of your time. You can see the 
I'm using the straw feed method here to get the product down onto the carpet. I'm just putting this little trigger here. It's going down into the pad, to the fiber pad, right down onto the carpet, and it's just wetting it. As I go along, that's what you call shawl feed. To flip this part and show you what it looks like on the other side. You can see I just flipped it over from the other side. So I'm gonna be using this side. I'm gonna show off this this room in here. So I started with this final part 
and you can see and you use this one side to do the whole that's the two room so you can see the contrast here still from where they had the table and as I said this is a commercial grade carpet and with this carpet over time after the constant um, movement the, the fiber tends to get very padded down and there's not much you can do to bring it back up but overall it's looking much better than it was this morning you can see the shading there still but there's not much I'm going to do about that I'm going to pass back here one more time with the fiber pad to see if I can get a bit much much better but I know there's not much we can do for that Sun is up. It's coming through the window there nicely. I know that little dusting we had last night is going to be all melted away. By the time I finish it, I'll go back outside. I know it's going to come, but for now, <laughs> I'm happy this type of weather get more done okay so we are finished with this job this morning as you can see how good the carpets came out for one last look and this was a move out move and clean carpets plus kitchen bathroom fridge stove as I said I don't do it on a regular but since this customer I have give me the, the jobs to clean the carpets they asked me if I would do the clean one thing and I just said yes so this is it for the day i shall see you guys on the next one